response dot set content type html okay here the same story repeats first we need to fetch the values from html page string name gender email phone number and password now get the writer print writer print writer writer equal to get writer and import this writer now establish connection between servlet and database try catch okay now register and establish database drivers connection con equal to null class dot for name driver manager dot get connection okay now write a sql query string sql equal to update date set users name equal to question mark gender equal to question mark phone number equal to question mark and password equal to question mark and i am giving the primary key value which is email as a where condition now execute the statement for execution we need to use prepared statement prepared statement dot psmt equal to connection dot prepare statement this is the sql query and now we are going to execute this query first psmt dot set string here we need to follow the order the first one is name second one is gender third one is email fourth one is password and last is email we need to follow this order only now execute this statement psmt dot execute update execute update which returns integer type int i equal to okay here also the same condition if it is one that means updation is successful if it is greater than one or less than one means updation failure we need to write that condition if i equal to equal to one means updation writer dot println user record updated successfully else writer writer dot println something went wrong please try again later that's it and close all connections psmt dot close and writer dot close and connection connection dot close now write exceptions first one is cas not found exception second one is sql exception Okay. which is available in java.sql package that's it and i don't see any errors save this one and save update.html save and here we need to give the url mapping url mapping is jdbc servlet dot update okay save this one run as run on server okay okay we need to give the same email id which you have entered previously my email id is samir uh, 185 at the rate of gmail.com and the name i want to change as sweet samir 
shake Samir and gender is male and I want to change my phone number 74 okay the password is Samir only before going to update let's check in database these are the values Samir at the rate of 185 at the rate of gmail.com this is primary key this is not going to be changed and the remaining values are to be changed now click on update update I think something is wrong it's showing one exception view our table does not exist that means we need to go to servlet page servlet page okay here the table name is different the table name is users and save and close this and run as run on server click okay it displayed the update page shake some and gender is new Samir 185 the rate of gmail.com and phone number and password click on update user record updated successfully now let's check in the database select starts from users okay you can observe previously the record values are this one and now the value is Sheikh Samir mail and phone number is changed to this one to this one and password remains same come back to our page and let's try to change the email Samir18 at the rate of gmail.com which is not available in the database let's check whether it is going to give user record successfully or something went too wrong let's check click on update something went wrong please try again later okay it's working fine in this way you can update the user's record by using update servlet now open these HTML pages at last you can observe you already have an account login that means if you click on this login button it will redirect it to login page and another one is you don't have an account then register here you are navigated to register page for that you need to give the URL the URL is register register dot html save and here you need to provide login dot html login dot html save this and now run this enter project on server go to your project and click on run as run on server and give the url login dot html click enter you don't have an account register click register here i forgot to give the project details also okay now go to this and here you need to provide jdbc jdbc servlet login html and for login also we to do okay save close this one and run this project on server okay now give the url login dot html L is capital okay login you don't have account register click register okay registration page opens and you already have account click login
login page displays. That's all about this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.